or staying in the River State ahead of the October 5 local government elections. Prince Favor Ruben, the national vice chairman of the Labour Party in the South South region, has accused the Action People's Party, APP, of handpicking its candidate at the River State Government House. Ruben alleged that Governor Simnilai Fubara and members of the People's Democratic Party are involved in this candidate selection process. He claimed these actions amount to anti-party activities that undermine the PDP's criticism of the 27 lawmakers who defected to the All Progressives Congress. Ruben also alleged that the APP's candidates who were endorsed by the governor are actually the PDP members who have not officially resigned from the party. What magic do they want to do that will make them win the election when the Labour Party that is everywhere is there? They have already said so. They have agreed. One of the commissioners in one of the local government came on board. He was on air and said, now that the governor endorsed their, their, their candidature now that they can now start. What does that implicate? You are running an election under a APP and a, 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 a PDP governor is endorsing your leave. What does that mean? It, it shows that actually they are running anti-party. And they are telling me simplify. Simplify is not the name of a political party in River State or in Nigeria. So, you know, the sweet thing that these politicians lies. What they say in the morning is different from what they are saying in the night. So whatever they said is all lies and fallacy. They know what they are saying. They know where they are going to. And so we are insisting that APP should not be part of this election. Now, the River State chapter of the APP called on the South South Vice Chairman of the Labour Party, Ruben Favour, to focus on preparing for the October 5 council election instead of engaging in mud slinging. River State is beyond any individual. It's our duty, irrespective of political parties we belong to, to defend the common interests of River State while negotiating our individual interests. We have concluded our primaries, like I said before. Candidates have emerged, 319 councillors of the 319 wards in River State, 23 council chairmen and their vices. And we're forwarded same to the organ authorized by law to, to conduct the election research. And it's only RISEC and INEC, as the case might be, that has authority to question the process or the legality of any political party primaries and congresses, not any individual. Ruben urged the State Independent Electoral Commission Chairman, retired Justice Adolphus Inibili, to uphold the law and ensure a free, fair, and credible election on October the 5th, while Woke Kuro emphasized that Ruben lacks the local standard to question the activities of the party. I'm calling on the reset to do the property. Don't allow any politician to rob their, their name. The average judge should not allow anybody to rob his name in the mall in the name of politics. He should do the right thing. Make sure there is free and fair and credible election. Let there be a level playing ground for all political parties that are participating. We are not begging for adoption. We are only saying we have credible candidates that will win election. And what we are asking the government to do is to allow us to do a free and fair election. It should not impose candidates on us from any party whatsoever. We are not interested in that. It's obvious that the political parties are afraid of the rising profile of Action People's Party in River State. And I've said it before, time with that number. This pool is going to be a test case for us to prove to River's people and indeed Nigerians that we are the party to beat. And after that, come 2027, we will not only be the party to beat in River State, but we will also be the party to beat at the national level. So anyone who is afraid of us, I will simply advise you, if you can't beat us, please come join us. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.